The live commentary may not abide to this rating. Viewer discretion is advised. This Let's Play of Kirby's Adventure is dedicated to Grant Thompson, aka the King of Random. Greetings, gamer girls. I am Celestine, also known as Cool Collection, and I welcome back more Kirby's Adventure. In the last episode, we took down the Butter Building. We broke it down like the. What was the last dungeon the Legends of the Link's Awakening called again? I don't remember. But thankfully, we didn't bur we didn't break it down. And despite despite the bosses being a sun and a moon. I'm honestly kind of surprised the whole thing didn't melt. Let's just go into level one. Wow, that was a great start. That uh, would have been a really great start if I fell off. Okay, just forget it. I'm not going to bother getting that power up. Although I am going to bother getting this power up. Well, I'm going to say the spark sucks. I don't know. It's been It's always been kind to me. Oh shoot, no, get out of the way! Oh yeah, I forgot, uh, I forgot, Kirby also has that move, um, what the, okay, if you, uh, if you, uh, hold down and press B, he'll do like a sl kick slide, I guess. Let me get the beam, actually. This will, be our, this will be a lot more useful. Oh, wait. Ow! Okay. This, okay, this enemy. Press B right now. Um, press B right now. The UFO! Look at this! We can move around freely now. UFO, hold down the B button to charge and, and then let go. You can attack with four diff uh, four different ways. Yeah, we press uh A we can press A we can do a B, but if we hold it we can charge it up and uh now, the longer we charge it, uh we can uh it will do more damage. Oh, or B, if you prefer. The UFO power, I'll admit, is kind of broken, though. Alright, uh, and I'm not going to get rid of it for that thing as much as I really want to show it. Oh, it. Fortunate, but I think we'll find it, find more of it later. It, unless we somehow lose this power, if I, and I'll be damned if we do. Yeah, you can tell how broken this is, but I don't think you can carry it between in levels, so it doesn't really matter anyway. So I'm going to use this as much as I so dang well please. Fortunately, we can't fire... Alright, I want to get rid of this thing before it causes us problems. There we go. Yeah, see, we don't carry it through the level. Oh, wait, there's still something in there. There's something I actually did... I I had mentioned is that uh, when you're in a stage you've already beaten, uh, if you pr if you pause, you can actually just exit it whenever you want. Uh, this enemy right, <sighs> what the freak? Come on, Goro, die! And again, that's not freaking blocks. Okay. Okay. This enemy right here, there. 
you do the ball power up. Kirby can roll into a smooth ball. If you hold the A button, he will jump higher. This power ball admit is not very useful. Are you for real right now? Come on. No! Well, apparently this game really did not... Apparently the, apparently the ball power-up is so freaking useless that the game didn't even want me to, to uh, show it. Okay, no. It's not that bad. I mean... I mean, you can roll around and you go a little bit faster and you bounce off stuff. But if you just... If you hold the button down, you can jump really high and... Actually... It's actually kind of fun. <laughs> Screw you people saying this power-up is useless. That's fun. Okay, whatever. Uh, now, uh, you notice that block right there is, a bit, is hollow. Uh, or I guess the opposite of hollow. Um, there's actually a... If I can get through it... A secret passage in it. Then we get the switch. That gives us the crane mini game. All right. Now let's finish the stage. Okay, uh, let's do this. Uh, I always try to go for the big Kirby. Oh yeah, but lands right there, you're pretty much almost guaranteed to get it. Okay, maybe not guaranteed. Woo. All right, here we go to two. This doesn't really look like a garden, it looks more like a castle. Oh, what? Oh, freaking graphics screwed me over. I didn't know this was a roof. Can we go past here? No, we can't. We gotta go around. Why is he not climbing the ladders? Isn't that what you do when you when you're near ladders, you climb them, you not you don't fly up them? And then again, I don't even think you can just climb I don't even think you can climb ladders and destroy all humans if I remember. I don't know, it was like it's been like twelve years since I since I've seen that game in person. That's what it was called, right? Destroy all humans? Aha! I... Ow. Let's see what we got in here. We got these things and the Maxim Tomato. I could really go for a tomato right now. I don't know about you guys, but I actually kind of like eating a tomatoes just on their own.
Those spikes look really spiky. Alright. Hey, look, the Poppy Bros! Alright, for these guys, all you gotta do is just, uh... Shoot their bombs back at them. Fortunately, there's two of them, so it's kind of hard. All right, now we're gonna be his brother. And we get that didn't do anything. Okay. There you go. We get a freebie anyway. There we got the shooting minigame, my favorite one. I want to beat the last one at least one. Sorry about that camera app crashed. I have no idea why I just started doing that. We gotta do this under 10 freaking milliseconds. Damn! I've done it before, I know I have. Now I see some airships in the background. I have a weird feeling about this. Oh, are you serious? Okay. Wait, get out, Kirby. You gotta get rid of this thing. So there's a fuse, and it despawned. How did it despawn? There we go. Okay. What you're supposed to do. Actually, I don't even know if this is really required. You just gotta. Uh, grab the fire, uh, light that, and get it in the cannon. And we get a free one up. No strings attached. Oh, jeez. Alright, actually wait. Oh crap, get out of the pit. Uh, there's a doorway that in there and I want to get to it. This just brings us to a Maxim Tomato. Uh, I don't know how you get to it though. Alright, let's get out of the airship then. Oh, there's a switch here. And I think the way you want to go is up here somewhere. Yeah, this is the way. What? It's not what I meant to do, but okay. Dang, how does that not hit us? Shoot, that was close.
All right, warp star. <laughs> we were trying to go that way. It was pushing us back. Alright, that opened up the uh, museum, in which you can get sleep or ball. I'm kind of tempted to just go for sleep, but I'm not going to do it. We have the arena, let's see who we're fighting. We have the Heracross. I think it's, uh, it's supposed to be up based off of some kind of... What's that beetle that like gra uh, grabs the... the rhinoceros beetle, right? I don't know, but I want this freaking back. I want this freaking back stage. Or what was it called again? Dude, freaking grab the things. Yeah, I'll admit this boss is kind of tough. What? Jeez. Why is it with me? And why am I playing so badly? I... I had something in my mouth. Come on, game. Don't lie. Dude! Ugh. Fine, fine, fine. Have it your way, game. Apparently, you're a freaking Kirby, Kirby cartridge. It's always Burger King. Okay, we're here now. I'd actually really like to have a parasol and be Princess Peach right now. Oh, wow. Wow, that's cool. Alright, we're going from being Peach to Link. Or Marth, if you prefer. I don't know, I kind of like Marth, even though I like, I like Zelda better than uh, Fire Emblem, I kind of like Marth a little bit better than Link. Mina. Me did it in Oh, that's really, yeah, something I keep forgetting to send to Mary. Oh well. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know what they want you to do here. Oh, wait, 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 we gotta get down there fast. Unfortunately, I didn't get to do it fast enough. Uh, I think what you're supposed to do is, uh... I think what you're supposed to do is, uh... Get down here before, uh... That, uh, shows up. I sincerely hope that there is not a switch under that. Because, oh my god, I do not want to do... That's going to be so freaking tough to do. Alright. Alright. Got this thing, which... Are you kidding me right now? There, take that to your face. I think this actually just gives it the stone power. Here we go. Oh, it actually gets the throw power. A 
That's cool. I love the little graphics down there. I mean, a little, uh, portraits down there. Is that what they would be, portraits? Alright, stages over already. And I swear to you, if that is what, if that's where a switch is, I'm gonna be so freaking pissed. Okay, thank goodness. Whew. Hey. Wait, it's that masked guy again. He's giving us a... Hyper game? Okay, whose side are you on, man? Because you've battled us. You're... It's like... It's like, it's like freaking Proto Man in Mega Man 3, where he might actually be a good guy, but you don't know that yet. This part's kind of jerkish. You're supposed to uh, fly and you gotta avoid the spikes. But there's also a. Uh, also a. Uh, entrance down here. I don't know how you're supposed to get to it. Oh, wait. Wasn't there a stone power up there? Oh, no, 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 no. You need the sword to do that. Okay, we're gonna go back then. Followed me up here, wow. There we go. Here we get a one up. And that's it. Wait a minute. What am I supposed to do? sword again. Now let's hopefully not die on the way there. Dang! I did that a bit too soon. Oh yeah, you just do that. But... You just go back through here? Oh, that wasn't even the way you were supposed to go. <laughs> That's what the problem was. Hey, it's the masked dude again. The guy who gave us a... A... Hyper candy at the beginning of the stage. He looks like he's looks like his minions have learned some new tricks. Jeez, I cannot help but get hit in this episode. 
Now we get 10 lives. What am I complaining about? Alright, that guy with the spear is annoying. Alright. Get through that and far over there. Okay. There's one like something fell right there. Oh well, it's probably just one of these stupid flying things. Actually, we can go uh, somewhere around here. So many freaking goros. We all know how much I hate I hate goros. Hate them with a bloody passion, but I still hate them. Maybe you're supposed to have the fireball when going through here. Alright, that's done. Now we're doing this. Yep, see that's what happens when you try to suck them up. What are you guys up to right now? It is currently 12.27 a.m. Yeah, we got this thing, which I actually find find easier if I fight him like this. Oh, wow, that beats him on one hit? Dang. Alright, I, I wanna eat that. Wait a minute, no, I don't think I want to actually. Um, I think right here, there's a secret entrance. No. I know whether in one of these dark rooms, in one of the, these levels, there is a secret entrance. And I think if you use the light, if I'm not mistaken, it will disappear. I don't know that for a fact though. Let me go back. Um, I didn't mean to use that. Oh well. Oh well. Uh... I guess we're gonna find. I guess we're gonna find out if the state, if the door is still, still gold. Uh, we have some pegs in here that we would need the hammer for. Though that you would keep the hammer all the way at this point, I'm not sure. Let me go ahead and grab that. You know what? I think there's actually a pe actually a switch under that. So 
Actually, it turns out I was incorrect about that. Uh, the, uh... The, uh... The dark areas can be spooky. This lets Kirby set off fireworks. It works only in the dark. Uh, I was actually incorrect about the switch being under those pegs. Um, it's actually, it actually is in this room, but it's not hidden. And, uh, using the light is actually how you find it. Um, it is right here. Boom. And that opens up the, uh, and that opens up the Warp Star area. All right, uh, I'm a crack, thank you. Uh, let's end here and fight the boss. Here, here we go, we have, uh, we have Cracko Jr. Wait. Wow, I learned how to fight this boss pretty quick. Um, you got this guy who gives you the high jump and he's here for a reason. Cause you gotta go up. Uh, don't, I don't know if you want to worry about attacking, uh, Krakow Jr. quite yet. You just kind of want to get to the top. Oh. I don't know. Let's see if you do. Can you attack him? Whoa! No, you can't. You just gotta go up. Oh, I love that sp those sprites, though. Kind of, this is like, uh, that one game that's in arcades. What's it called? The one where you play as the weird-looking thing and you jump up? Here we go! This is Cracko! Uh, that's not how you fight him. Uh, of course, um, He's definitely a lot tougher than he was in Dreamland, I'll give you that. Of course I missed. He, uh... Actually, do you just high jump into him? Yeah, you can just high jump into him. That's, uh... That's actually a bit tougher to do, so I think I'm gonna... Not die, please. Wow. Uh... Jeez, how do you freaking hit him? I really do not remember how to fight this boss. Maybe you really, maybe you are supposed to just use the high jump. Ugh. What, you're telling me I gotta do that whole freaking thing again? This is really freaking stupid. Let's not die before we get there. Come to think of it, I think you actually are just supposed to just, just supposed to just high jump into him. Uh, make sure you just just make sure you uh, turn when you uh, uh, when you need to. Try to stay in the corner um, if he's gonna do um, like. Come on, I need the give it back. Give it back, man. Okay. Yeah, this is how you're supposed to fight him. There you go. Alright, level 5. Yogurt Yard. 
But guys, I think we are going to end the video off here. Next time on Kirby's Adventure, we are going to take on the Yogi Yard. I will see you guys next time. And as always, remember to smile. You were the face of the whole collection in the night gaming. Goodbye.